What's good guys? I'm back and a lot paler because I just scrub off my spray tan. But I'm with Danielle. Hi! And we're in Paris! Wow, that was so high. <laughs> Hi! Hi. <laughs> guys, we're in Paris. Obviously the first stop was Balenciaga. Yeah, because we wanted the cup. Oh yeah, we did. Yeah. So Danielle found this photo of this really cute like coffee cup that had like Balenciaga on it. So we thought they had a cafe. But they don't. But they don't. Someone just like either photoshopped it or like made it. No, he did say that they had it at one point. Oh, okay. But it was gone now. Okay. So. Um, so we just put on some casual looks to shoot that we wouldn't wear to a fashion week related event because they're too casual. <laughs> and we shot those. And um, Danielle's friend's meeting us, so fun little addition to the trip. She's coming in now. Yeah. She's an Uber, so we're going to meet her on the Champs-Élysées. Yes. And then we will get some food, because I'm freaking hungry. <laughs> okay guys, so this is my first outfit of the week. I'm doing a more street style look, so we've got this PU leather jacket by Naked, paired with this Naked neon fanny pack, which is super in, um, especially for the upcoming seasons. Then I have this Rixo graphic tee that I got at the presentation, paired with my favorite 501s by Levi's and my Doc Martens. And I almost forgot. <laughs> And of course, my lace back glasses. Alrighty guys, so it is now dinner time and we have decided to go to Le Marais to have our dinner. So we are at this new restaurant that we just found on Google. It's called Derriere and hopefully it's super yummy. We're kind of like starving because we've been out all day and like I barely ate and I was kind of hungover this morning. So yeah, um, my face is a little bit red. I do have a bit of rosacea so. Um, that's probably what that is, but anyway, hopefully the food's good. I'll show you guys what we have and yeah. Guys, look at this. Oh my god. Okay guys, so we found a speakeasy somehow. I feel like I'm gonna draw some too. We found a speakeasy at this restaurant, so they took us into the room upstairs so we could have some drinks because they don't have a table ready right now. And I found this girl that I love following on Instagram. She was sitting downstairs. Her name's Taylor Shea, Lachey, which was really fun. I feel like we always run into celebrities when we travel. What is up? It is our first full day in Paris, but technically our second day here. We're all just getting ready right now. There's Danielle over there. And um, basically what we're going to do today is I have a takeover. So I'm pretty excited. I have all my looks laid out here. Um, but somehow I have to manage to change four times today, which will be interesting. And I think the plan for today is pretty much content creation, right? Yeah, we have some places mapped out. Thanks to um, we're going to La Marais again and then make our way to a special place for dinner tonight around the Eiffel Tower. Around the Eiffel Tower. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Okay, so yeah, so there's a lot going on, but um, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing right now because I'm going to be changing four times, so we'll see a bunch of looks today. So we have this tracksuit sort of thing by Naked, so it has like it's kind of windbreaker material. It's really cute, and then I just paired it with this um, white crop tee that I got from Aritzia. Nike sneakers with some Adidas socks that honestly smell really bad. I need to wash these, but I have nothing left, so we'll just have to do for now. So as you guys saw, we just had an amazing, pretty healthy meal at Saison. It was super delicious. I got the avocado benedict, which is not that, that healthy, but it was super good on gluten-free bread. So I highly recommend if you guys want to check it out. 
And if you do eat meat, um, the pancakes come with bacon and they looked amazing. Katrina had them and yeah, I definitely recommend those too. But anyway, um, I just left them because I'm headed to a hair appointment at Christoph Robin. So we're gonna do some, probably just style it for tonight um, because we are going to an event after it, which I will take you guys along with me to. And then after that, we're going for dinner to a super fun restaurant, but I don't know where we're going. So the girls ended up staying up until like, godly hours in the morning um, planning what we were gonna do so they picked the restaurant they made a reservation so I'm very excited to go and apparently we can dress up so I might be saving or might be wearing my favorite outfit um, that I packed tonight for that so hopefully you guys will take a peek at that but yeah right now I'm just gonna go with my hair done I'll show you guys the details I'm wearing so I'm actually borrowing this from Katrina it's this really cute pearl headband that matched my little pearl earrings here by Thai Studios which I will link down below and then I have my Chanel coin necklace and my outfit is just this oversized blazer with a naked top and my Topshop jeans with my Louis Vuitton boots. Okay guys, so we're back at the room and I have a new hairstyle. Thanks to the Christoph Robin salon, I went in and they kind of curled it. They said my hair is too short to curl, which makes sense which, for why I can't do it. But they basically like made it a little bit wavy and then just like more voluminous and kind of glam. And then on my way, I stopped and got some snacks because you guys know I love snacks. And I found these balls that I have to show you because they're so good. So they're like these protein, vegan protein balls, but they have peanut butter inside of them and it's like soft. So yeah, thought I would share. They're called Funky Veggie. So our reservation is at 8.30, right? Eight. eight. Oh, at eight. So we have an hour. So we're gonna get changed in our glam outfits and then we'll see where we're going because I still have absolutely no idea. <laughs> Should I call? If you can. All right guys, so we're almost ready. We're gonna be late, but we'll make it because we're manifesting we're gonna make it. We're and <laughs> this is my look. I'll show you in detail later. We'll do like a pan up and down, but um, yeah, excited. So we made it and check out this view. It's such an amazing view, but they're moving all of their patio furniture right now, which is really fucking annoying and not the time to do it. Drinks are mediocre. We'll see how dinner goes. A couple more. So as you just saw, we were at Angelina, which is a pretty classic place here to have breakfast or high tea or I guess snacks because a lot of people in Europe have like a meal around five before dinner. Um, but anyway, we did that and then we just went to the Jardin de Tuileries to shoot a little bit of content, get this look out of the way. This here is a Zara dress and it's like this pale yellow color, which is really cute. Um, and of course, you guys know I love the puff shoulders, but we're all dressed up and we are going to change and then head over to Palais Royal. No. Uh, no, Musée Rodin. Musée Rodin to uh, try and see if we can get into the Dior show. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so we just walked outside of the Dior show and we walked all the way through to the front area and then just past it and it was amazing. Like all the street style photographers were taking shots of us and it felt super legit. And I saw Nagin, which I was really excited about. And we also saw Moritz too, so. That was super exciting. We didn't get in, but honestly, 
the thrill was enough and like you never know where your photo's gonna go so I think that's super key because you gotta just like fake it till you make it. We all kind of switched outfits too. I'll show you quickly. No, actually, I'll do this. So we've got a cute little striped ensemble here. This is very Chanel too, I think. It's like kind of dark. It's like darker than like the florals there, but some people were wearing yeah. like pretty dark. Things. And then we have Danielle with her more floral look. Um, however, I am wearing sneakers now because I was wearing heels that are like really uncomfortable and I have to walk slow in, so. Now we're just gonna go shoot some content and see what else is good. pharmacy I don't know it looks fucking good they have avocado toast some snacks the side bowls so I'm gonna get dressed changed out of this although I am wearing a Lorena bodysuit I'll plug that in right there guys shop link in bio you already know this is the moss style with like the bustier detailing um, but yeah so I'm going to get changed in the car and then hop into the restaurant to eat some food and I'll show you guys what's up and welcome to our last day in Paris yesterday we kind of had a little bit of a or you saw the last um, footage which was us hysterical after trying to shoot in the heat um, under the Arc de Triomphe but after that we kind of just like went to eat had a pretty chill day for the most part um, and yeah I'm just gonna pick back up today and show you guys around our final day because we have some exciting things planned. Um, first, I'll show you my look that we're gonna go shoot and we're gonna go to La Venue, which is a pretty famous cafe in, in Paris. Um, it's a little pricey, but the view's great. So I am wearing right now just this look that I, this look, this look that I wanna shoot, which is this oversized like satiny men's shirt from Zara with this deluxe chokers um, chain belt that you guys have seen before some gucci tights thank you matt for getting me those like last christmas and this men's oversized blazer from zara and then i paired it with my doc martens and these earrings here by h&m so i will take you guys along with us and hopefully you enjoy our final day here Alrighty guys, what's good? Welcome back. So we went to La Venue. We got some food. I'll insert a clip of what we had. It was kind of like bougie in there, so I didn't want to whip up my camera. Um, but anyway, we did a quick change. As you can see, I'm wearing or opted for a more chilled out look. Also found out Josephine was at the restaurant while we were there in a corner at La Venue. So I wish I kind of saw her because she's one of my favorite Instagrammers at the moment. Anyway, so now I switch into Danielle's oversized hoodie with my men's blazer from H&M. We took a quick walk and look what we found. Ta-da! What's up guys? We are now having a drink, or we just finished having a nice glass of red wine as well as Danielle got her French onion soup. How was it? 
It was amazing. I wanted it all trip and I finally got it. I feel like jealous that I didn't have it now. And then I got a goat cheese salad, which I actually wanted to get yesterday, so I'm happy I got it today. It's the only lettuce I've had since. Um, so it just stopped raining, so the sun is out. But we have to go because it's almost dinner time for us, which is jokes. It's 6.17 and we're going to Montmartre for 8. God, we actually We've been so healthy. We're, we just ate at five, and then we're going to dinner at eight. Well, we walked. It's fine. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys my last outfit later. This is the same outfit we were in before. Janelle shot this right in front of the Eiffel Tower, and guys, money shot. And, and now I kind of want one, but like it's because it's sunny. But like, I kind of just want to like. We need to go. Yeah. <laughs> and we need to go to Montmartre. But it's in the dark, yeah. Chill and, yeah. and start drinking and eating again. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, until then. <laughs>